trip to down south to Bluff Knoll. I'm sorry, Pete, I went without you. from Bluff Nol. Um, um, we stopped to take photos because we're Asian. And um, yeah, check out this long road. Cute emo walking music. This is the Sterling Range. We're going to be climbing up one of them peaks soon. Uh, hello, this is definitely not a motor vlog. I shall call it a mountain vlog. So, right now, I'm currently close to the summit to, um, to the summit of Bluff Knoll. My sibling is behind me making noise. <laughs> but, whilst we walk, let's talk about life. Since life it's full of mountains that we have to climb. <laughs> That's a big thing. So, there are many songs about mountains uh, used as metaphors in terms of facing problems in life. And, you know, sometimes these mountains are big, sometimes they're small little hills, or little moguls. Know, life's bumpy road but <coughs> whilst walking up here I was just wondering you know, what are the things that help you overcome such mountains in your life I mean, not many people out there have the blessing of being able to be self-motivated some people are motivated by other people my question is what motivates you to overcome problems in life. Whatever it is, leave it in the comment below because I'd be really interested to know how different people overcome different things. I mean, there's been a lot of things that's happened in my life. Uh, growing up, I grew up with an extremely rebellious nature the problem child <laughs> but you know the things I went through helped me grow up and, you know, if you're going through a tough time be it heartbreak not knowing where you're going in life just know that really you're not alone there's there's other people out there who are also feeling the same way but what you need to do is just stop overthinking everything it's good to just stop and smell the air <laughs> as cliche as that sounds but it's good to just take a pause take a break sit down and just look at what all your strengths are maybe a small little piece of strength but it's still strength it's still something that maybe you can work on, develop it, make it grow, and use it to your advantage. Let's just hope it's a good strength, alright? Nothing deceptive or anything. 
<laughs> no, we got lost. Because nobody is perfect. I grew up with the value that success comes in the form of success. Comes in the form of perfection. If you want to be successful, you need to be perfect. In reality, you can't please anyone. No one is perfect. Perfection is not does not determine success. Money does not determine success. What determine determine success? I reckon. I believe it's contentment with your, in yourself. You know, and when you're content and at peace with yourself, you realize that it doesn't just spread to you, but it spreads to others around you as well. And not saying that. I want to sit back and be lazy. I still work hard, but it's being content and at peace despite all the problems in life. That is what I consider success. It's, it's when those problems, it's when those problems are things control the direction your life is going. So. If you're feeling overwhelmed, take a break. Sit down, lay it all in front of you, and realize that clinging onto these problems isn't going to help you. Clinging onto it won't change anything. Because the only way to change is to look up and forward. Life is all about overcoming fears and problems. It's by staring you straight in the face and saying, You won't defeat me. Because I'm not alone. None of us are alone.